Here we go, here we go, up before the sun. Side of the boat, that we know what side what tuna is working. So we'll keep the hot stuff over here on this side, okay. and the sweet stuff, the, the salmon. Blend. I like that. Did you guys get that on camera? Uh, so, anybody has any questions, we can go back to film. So, we got <laughs> we got garlic and all that on this side. Hey, so this is so. kind of the, the go to this morning. We're gonna see what happens. Pink. Uh, Pink these are custom pork. baits. Are you guys rigging up over here? Secret stuff, or? yeah, yeah. This is where, where all the magic so happens got, right here. Ray, Ray? Yeah. There he is. Everybody's gonna turn around. I mean, it feels. Is it still hot? How many lights? How much light did it feel out? Yeah, he's, he's at 140 right now. He probably went out 180. Yeah, I feel it, man. How's it feel, dude? It feels. It feels like I'm trying to pull a plug from the river. <laughs> we hit the right place, guys. You see adjustment. Yeah, we did. The name of the game, baby. Yeah, that's it. Roll in, baby. Roll in. <laughs> Dang it, baby. We're at 100 Dang feet. 100 feet right here. There's like. Yeah, yeah, no head shake. <laughs> they got me on the left-handed retreat. Hey, 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 no slack, no slack. Drill down on me. Yeah, well, you don't want head shake here. Uh, okay, okay, go ahead. So what I'm gonna have you do. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna net. I want you over here on this side. It's down. It's down. Be down. So am I just rushing him in? Just letting no, him play. He's gonna, he's gonna get here and he's gonna make like three more runs. Okay. Okay. Really? Yeah. Oh no. Okay. okay. Good. Nice one. Yeah. I'm, I'm killing the motor here. Reel up a little bit over here. Oh, dude, this is so crazy. This is unreal. This buckle is fixed for sure right now. Okay. I just don't want to be too excited because I, I freak out too much. But, dude, this is this is cool, dude. This is unreal. All right, you're 20 feet out. You're good, you're good. 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 It's gonna make a couple runs. Dude, this is so dope. Real, real, real. I see him, dude. Oh, Holy this cow, this is PB. This is PB for sure. <laughs> Biggest fish I've ever caught in my life. Real down, no, nice and easy. Always do the weight. Always down to the weight. And then up. put your thumb on the line. Lift up slow. Lift up. Lift up. Lift up. Yeah! yeah. Oh. Yes! Let's get it. Get it. Get it. At least yeah. like 15 pounds. Let's go! Hey, we gotta get back up there. We gotta get back up there. Let's go! Throw him in. Okay, get a video. It's huge. More. Oh my I'm say, god. I'm gonna say 16. I'm gonna say 20. I'm gonna say monster. I'm gonna say 20. Oh, okay. 21, that 22. Looks a big. No, I'm gonna Dude, say what I'm gonna the say 18. Heck? Look at this thing. Here. It's so freaking gorgeous. It feels it feels super slimy. Woo! Dude, hey, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Holy cow, dude, my arm was burning. Hey, on, on, on the Yakima. On the Yakima. Dude, Mark, show him. Oh my Look at them, baby. The new Yakima. What is this? Spin what fish. fish. Is this? Is this a big like wild, wild nook. Big Looks nook. like a male. Dude, it's beautiful, like, yeah, dude. It's, it's so beautiful. Big buck. Look at that. Crazy. So crazy. I can't believe this. Shout out to Isaiah for the invite. Oh, I'm so jacked. Dude, my adrenaline's <laughs> just pumping right now. How that feel, dude? Dude, little, it's crazy. Little arm. So crazy. I got a little sore forearm little sore. right now. Yeah. That's so cool. Right, before we do anything with this fish, let's get back up here, we'll get fishing, and then we'll take care of that fish. Sweet, sweet. Woo! I'm 
so pumped. Good guys. Oh yeah. yeah. It's hey, a release, sir. Hold it up for the we just catch a release, oh, I know, buddy. I know, I just... What? Right back into the oven. No! <laughs> This is like the biggest fish I've ever caught in my life right here. Holy cow. This thing's just so gorgeous. Look at that thing. Holy cow. All right, let's get a weight on her. For him, it's a buck. It's a yep. buck. The way, the way you can tell, look how the nose, nose is kind of turning now. Uh, all right, all right, zero Dude, that's a tank, dude. Yeah, definitely biggest fish I've ever caught my life. Ooh. I know my fish, Gorgeous, dude. gorgeous. gorgeous. Oh, bonus fish. We caught one. Oh, oh, oh. fish, fish. See? Oh, there it see? is. There it is. See? They know where we're going to go. See? They know, dude. See? I told you, Woo! man. Yes. Yes. Dude. That's the buzzer, just, buzzer see, fish here. See what I mean? And you guys want to give up, man? Never give up, Mike Akinelli. Never give up. <laughs> Woo! Oh no. What? Mark, get the net. Mark, get the net. Oh. The I, I, it popped off, bro. No, no. It's gone. I felt it pop off. Roll up, roll up all the lines. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Yeah. yeah. There was the, I just cut this one. It's a nice Cromer. Cromer. Not too bad. Cromer. What do you think? What do you think? It's going to be nice and red. Oh, yeah, it looks good. There we go. Jeez, a nice piece right huge, there. Dude. Okay. Okay. Got one? You got one? Yeah, it's a nice big walleye. I told I you guys we're gonna go walleye fishing and not get walleye. I gotta get one bite. Got to. I ripped it out of the. Oh, what is it? Bass? It's a walleye. Here we go, all the way in, nice and easy. Nice, nice, nice. 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 <laughs> all right, all right, all right. We're on the board. Eater, little eater right there. Oh, yeah, he came all the way out. Yo, you got it. Big, big boy. What do you think? About 32. <laughs> At least centimeters. A little bit, bro. <laughs> and right when I'm gonna send the trouble, like, don't pull it. You're like, oh, yeah. Yeah, that's a good solid thing. So, taking the, the bone, the rib cage. So, when you do eat these, yeah. there's bones right here that you have to peel out. We usually just get a. Tweezers. Like tweezers, yeah. yeah. Other than that, it's a solid piece. Dinner fillets. You get it redder than that? Oh, they get they get a little redder, but this is good. This is good for the area. This bonus walleye. How do we get a hold of you? Uh, just give me a Facebook ma message. Sweet. Hit me up. I'll leave his info uh, in the you description say, below. Yeah. Uh, I don't have any openings until probably next year. Okay, so, yeah, I'm booked up. Yeah, I'm all booked up for the rest of the year. year. So, wait, what do you got there, video. Mark? A little, a little small jaw right here. Dude, that, that one, you, that's a weir. <laughs> Let me see what kind of jointed raptor. That's a one I'd of a kind about, raptor. That's hey, hey don't, don't show flash. that. Don't show that. That's oh, a secret yeah, stuff right secret there. Lift that one up. There he is, man. Got some bait. On cut plug. Oh, That's dude. a big one right there, dude. Good stuff, Isaiah. Thank <laughs> you right. today, guy. Got yeah, it. Yeah, shout out to Isaiah, man. I'm gonna salmon go. today? Yeah, let him go. We got salmon today. That's, we got a king check. today. Check. We got a smallie. Smallie, check. We got a walleye. And a check. It's just whatever we wanted, we, we threw yeah. it on and we caught it today. What's going on, everybody? This is Mark from Fishing the 509. You just got done watching me catch my first ever salmon. Uh, it was an experience I'll never forget. I was super excited, super thrilled. Just the entire adventure of being out on the water and chasing these beautiful creatures was definitely 
one I'll never forget. So huge shout out to Isaiah Suarez for inviting me out on the boat. Um, if you can see here, we have a piece of uh, King Salmon. Gorgeous piece, Isaiah, after we caught it, he even cleaned it up for me, as you guys can see in the video. And so right now, we are gonna prep this fish and we're gonna cook this fish, and then uh, we're gonna try it and see what it tastes like. We're gonna turn our piece of salmon over, and we are going to what's called score the skin. And the reason for this is when you cook fish, if you were to cook it skin side down in the pan, the fish will actually start taking a different shape because that skin, when it starts getting cooked, it kind of disfigures the fish. So what you do is you just take your knife and you just go ahead and cut through that skin just a little bit. That way it maintains its shape as it's being cooked. And then we're gonna take some of my favorite stuff right here. Huge shout out to Bees Rubs. This is actually their seafood rub that they have. They are local here to the Pacific Northwest. Make sure you guys check them out. I will leave their information down in the description below. Um, so we're gonna put a little bit of this dry rub on this salmon and then we're just gonna put salt pepper and then we're just gonna throw it right into the frying pan. So we're gonna go with the rub and on a salmon, it's just a beautiful delicate fish. You don't wanna overdo it. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna lightly coat the salmon with some of the rub. Usually with rub you want to be really heavy, but I'm not trying to take away the flavor of this fish. We're just going to go light on it. So there's some salt with pepper, and then we're going to do it to both sides. So we're going to turn it over, put on the skin there, grab some salt, rub that on there, and then also scoring it helps get some of that seasoning and salts into the middle of the fish. We are going to start our pan. If you put oil in a cold pan, your oil actually starts to burn first. So you want that pan nice and warm before you put your oil in. We're gonna take about a teaspoon of olive oil, put that in there, and then we're gonna lay our salmon in here. And we're gonna lay it away. And that's what you wanna hear. You wanna hear that nice sizzle. All right, and you wanna just press down on that. Oh, it smells amazing. And almost instantly you can see that that salmon starting to change color along the bottom. And one thing too, when you're cooking salmon or a delicate fish like this, you always want to cook the fish like 70% on skin. Let that heat travel up the fish and then you want to turn that fish over and cook the top. What we're going to do is now we're going to flip it over to the top and we'll only leave it there just until we start noticing the colors start coming in and then we will uh, flip it back over to cook on the skin. So we're going to take that fish I'm gonna turn it. So you get that nice caramelization of the skin. What we're gonna do is we're gonna add some knobs of butter in here just to make sure that fish stays extremely moist. I'm gonna go ahead and baste that. That butter's got seasoning in it. It's just a lot more flavorful. You can see now I'm getting a nice cook on the top of the fish. You can just see that fish just soaking in all that butter. Also, I'm not a big fish eater. If you're new to the channel, I'm not a huge fish eater, but salmon is the one fish that I actually eat. And when I told my friend I'd never caught a king salmon, he was like, there's no way you've never caught a king salmon. I gotta get you on your first fish. I think what convinced him was I told him that I only ever eat salmon from Chinese restaurants, like the buffets. And he was like, no, dude, we can't be having that. I'm going to put you on your salmon. And sure enough, he did. So again, shout out to Isaiah. Um, this fish is almost done. We're gonna turn heat to low here. We're just gonna let it make sure we're cooking it thoroughly down to the center, but it just smells amazing. It's just got that smell. It's hard to explain. It almost smells like the ocean. You can almost smell the ocean in the fish and it just, it just smells amazing. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna get ready to plate this guy and then we're gonna try it out and then uh, it's gonna be amazing and delicious. So I can't wait. We are gonna start off with some brown rice that we made, this guy. We're gonna make it look fancy today. Just gonna to press down on this guy. Dang, look at that. All right, then we're gonna take some potatoes that we made. Just gonna slap a little bit of those on here. We're gonna take our, the star of the episode, which is that King Salmon. Just take a look at that thing. You cannot tell me that does not look delicious. But we're gonna take this guy and we are going to just lay him down. Boom! Take a look at that. You can't tell me that this just does not look 
amazing. Cue the music and slow motion shot here. Look at that, we'll take this. We'll wipe this up. Gordon Ramsay, shout out to Gordon Ramsay. This will be, this is actually extremely rewarding because I caught this fish. This less than 24 hours ago, this fish was swimming by. He offered himself to us. We caught him, we appreciate that fish and we're gonna eat it right now. So we're gonna try it out. You cannot forget the lemon on it. And then you just wanna add just a little bit of lemon along the top. All right, that's a lot of lemon, but all right. So we're gonna try it out. We're gonna take a piece from right here. We're gonna get a little bit of rice and then a little bit of that potato. And we're gonna try it. <sighs> Cheers to you guys. Come on camera, I forget. Holy cow guys, this fish is incredible. And I'm not just I'm not just saying that because of the video. Again, I'm not a fish eater. I'm not a person who eats fish. This right here honestly is one of the best things I've ever eaten. The fish is just so fresh, it's it's hard to explain. It's almost funny. This fish tastes like, it tastes like a steak. If th That's the only way I can really say it. I don't know if it's the seasoning and the rub, but the fish has almost zero, zero taste of fish. We're gonna go with just some fish right here. It just tastes so fresh and again, it, it in a sense, it is rewarding. We grinded for this fish yesterday, but it is just insane how delicious this fish tastes. Like, I I really can't put it into words. Um, it just complements so well with the rice. It's so well with the potato. This dish is just incredible. With that being said, guys, thank you for watching Fish in the 509. If you're new to the channel, feel free to subscribe, drop a comment down below, say hello. Um, I'm gonna finish eating this. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace out.